M0FXB, welcome back to my videos on the RF918HF transceiver. So I had a question about the display. Can we mess around and change the display? And you definitely can. So what you do is you press menu and then you turn this knob, that's the middle knob, until you see you turn it until you see display. There it is there. And then to show, you just turn this knob. And then you've got all these settings. So as you go through, you've got S meter calibrate. Spectrum type is dual. Now, if I change that with this knob to scope and then just exit, you'll see we've just got the scope. Go back in. And it's remembered where we are. And we can go to dual. Well, let's just do waterfall, exit. And now you've got the waterfall full screen. Now this is the Nazir firmware. This is the group page. I'll link you in where you can get that firmware. So let's go back in, menu, and then we'll go back to the one I like is dual, okay? And that's, you get dual. Oh, did I select that? Do that again, menu. They are dual exit. There's dual. Let's go back in again. Menu. So that's dual. Then you've got spectrum, magnify, waterfall speed, scope speed, spectrum filter, scope division. I haven't tried that one. 10 dB it says there. So let's leave it at 10 dB and we'll change it to... Remember it was 10 dB. We'll put it to 5 dB, see if we see anything different. Okay. Is that the division here? Then we go menu, change it back to 10. Exit. So try that. You can see it does have an effect on the scope, doesn't it? The thing about these radios, they are there's, there's hundreds of functions that you can change and the settings. So let's keep going. Spec frequency scale color, white. Filter bandwidth display is green, so you change in more colors. TX carrier color. Scope light is on. Scope. AGC adjustment, trace color, background, and it just goes on. Transparency. So with these kind of things, you just like play around, like the color of the waterfall, it says rainbow, so multicolored. Contrast, step size, upper meter color. That's all your meters here. Frequency display mo um, font. So let's do that one. Modern. Is it going to let me change that one? Oops. It doesn't seem to want to let me change that one. LCD auto blank. Step size marker and menu inverse scaling. And so on. So let's just exit. So that's it really. Exit with the button here. Just, you know, regarding the display, just have a little little play. Even with the original firmware, it's, you know, it's a similar idea. You're going into the display settings and making adjustments. Thanks for watching my videos on the RS918. The, the link for the other firmware is in the description and the purchase for this. And if you're finding my videos helpful, please buy me a coffee. Bye for now, 7-3.